Here's another quick one which is going to work your heart rate, it's going to work your abs and it's going to work your arms. We're going to do Nadia jumps in burpee jumps with a press up if you can, ideally a press up if not just the jump. From that we're going to go straight in a long arm plank, hold the long arm plank, plank changing arms, changing legs to work the core a little bit harder. Here we go. Starting with Nadia jumps, so we're jumping up, roll back, in or hold, up, jump in a little bit of pee, and press up. That's one. In or hold, coming up, jump, bit of pee. That's two. Again, three. Hold. Make sure the hold you keep your bag into the floor. Coming up, jump. Six, press up, shift to the floor. Up, number seven. Look at your feet, rolling up, jump. Eight, don't forget to breathe. This is number nine. Look at your toes, and up, jump. Jump in, jump up, last one, ten. Roll back, back into the floor. Come up, jump. When you're coming up, get your forehead forward. In, reach up, back down. We've got a long arm plank from here. Holding it out. Pressing your belly button right into your spine. Your bottom's down. Sit from the side, keeping it nice and long. If you feel okay here, I'd like you to lift your right leg. Again, don't let your back sag, your back go up. Keep a nice straight line, belly button in the spine, and change, left leg. And change, right leg. And change, left leg. And hold, alternative to this, if you're struggling a little bit, get your elbows down, keep your belly button in your spine still. If this is difficult also, don't give up. Keep your belly button in your spine, drop your knees, keep it up. I'd rather this than back arching, than arching it up, okay? Belly button in the spine, hold it here. We've got 20 pulses here, six, seven, go, 20. 10, twist, 20, hit no obliques, 10, 6, hold it here, come up, don't drop it, turning on one side, give me a nice long side plank, again, if this is a little bit too difficult, I'd like you to go down onto your elbow, so drop your hand, jump down onto your elbow, keeping the lift through the side. Again, imagine there's a piece of string pulling your hips off the floor. Sometimes if you use your imagination, it makes things a little bit easier. Imagine somebody else is pulling your hips up. Obviously if someone else was, it would be easier, but it's not. Nothing's worth having unless you've worked hard for it. Eh? And hold it here. If this is even difficult as well, like I said, drop a knee. Keeping it up.